Hello everyone, this is Yamin and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can make a simple solar system animation using HTML and CSS. So we'll have a sun over here, we'll have our earth, a moon and a galaxy background image. So I'll show you everything step by step from the very beginning. So let's go and start writing our code. So we'll go to our, here you can see in the HTML, we have our HTML structure over here and inside this body, we are going to mention a div over here. Then inside this div, uh, we are going to mention a class over here. Class name will be container. Then since we have a sun, we need to mention a div for a sun. So here, the div class, it will be sun. And inside this div plus sun, we have two more div over here. One will be earth and another one will be moon. So let's say div, it will be class R. Then uh, let me just pop it paste it here and this one will be moon so we'll have every div inside this container and then we'll have a class sun and inside this div class sun we'll have div class art and moon so right now let's go and write some css for the sun so here i already link the standard css over here you can see in the head section so here i'll just directly go to style.css so here inside the style.css, let's just uh, first mention one here, margin, it will be 0px and padding, it will be 0px and we'll see one more thing which is box sizing, it will be border box. So right now, uh, if we just open it over here, here you can see there is nothing obviously. So first of all, let's go and design our sun over here. So in our design our sun over here, here we already mentioned the class sun. So here, let's just show one here, dot, sun, then two second bracket, since this is a class, we need to give a dot. And here, first the sun height, it will be, let's say, 175px, then width, it will be, it will be, same thing, 175px. Since we want to make a circle, so height and width must be same, then we are going to show it here, border, radius, it will be. 50 parcel so it will make a circle so we need to mention a background color let's say for now background color is red and the position it will be absolute for sun so right now set this then if we now refresh here here you can see we have a red color one here but this doesn't look like a sun so we are going to change the color from background red to let's show it here rgb uh, 255,81,0 Set this, then let's refresh here There you can see it now looks like a sun So right now let's just add some color or shadow over here at the end of the circle So let's go back So here in this class sun we are going to show over here box shadow It will be 0, 0, 0075px Then RGBA And let's say it will be this one, 255, on for on, 0 on, save, then let's refresh, and there you can see there is some shadow color over here. So right now we need to have the sun in the center over here. So let's go back to our core, and here you can see that we have a class over here, div class container. So let's go to style.css, and here we're going to say dot container, we'll give to second bracket. We're going to first say over here with it will be 100 kW then height it will be 100 kH then we are going to show here display it will be flat then justify content it will be center and then we need to show here align items it will be center as well so everything in our browser will be in the center so right now if we set this then if we now refresh here there you can see our sun is in the center so right now we need to have a galaxy image as the background. So for it, we are going to say over here, background, we will say on here URL to first bracket to single quotation. And here you can see I have a galaxy image over here. So I'll give this link in the description so that you can download this image. So we are going to say over here, the image name is galaxy.jpg. We are going to say over here galaxy.jpg. So right now save, then if we now refresh here, here you can see it look like this. So right now we need to have art and moon image over here and we need to make them rotate the sun. So right now uh, here you can see I already have the art and the moon image over here. 
so i will give the image link in the description so that you will also be able to download the art and the moon image from there okay so right now let's go to our index.html and here you can see inside sun here you can see we have the class art over here so we are going to go to the style.css over here and here we are going to set dot art we'll give to second bracket so here first we are going to mention the art height and width let's say height it will be 75 px then width it will be 75 px as well then we are going to say over here border radius it will be 50 percent so it will make it circle so right now we mentioned the image name over here so the image will be url and here you can see the art's name is art.jfif so we are going to show here art.jfif this is the extension for the art image over here and we also need to show over here position it will be relative since the art will rotate the sun so right now if we save then if we now refresh here there you can see we have the art over here it is also in the center so right now let's also have a moon over here so uh, right now we'll say over here dot art clone after so this is for moon design so let me just show over here moon so uh, what we'll do is that we'll show over here content it will be null so inside this Add after what we do is that wherever there is art, the moon will follow the art. So we must need to uh, give coordinate to null. So right now we need to mention the width for the moon. So let's say moon width it will be 45 px. Then height it will be 45 px as well. Then we are going to make it round. So we are going to sort here border radius 50 percent. The position for the moon will be absolute it will only follow the art so we need to right now give the moon image so let's say background it will be url and our moon image is full moon dot wbp so we are going to start here full moon dot wbp so right now if we set this then if we now refresh over here here you can see the moon image over here but it is black over here so let's go back to our code and here we are going to show on here border it will be none then background size it will be power save then refresh and here you can see we have the wool over here so right now we want this to rotate the sun so for it we need to write some keyframe so let's go back to our code and here we are going to say at the end of keyframe then we just need to give a random name let's show it here art orbit you can name it anything then we'll give to second bracket and here we need to mention how we want our r to rotate so we need to say our here form and true so it will uh, in the form we'll mention the starting and in the two we'll mention the ending so in the form we are going to show over here cans form so first we'll say rotate and it will be let's say it will start from zero degree so zero teg then it will move a little bit uh on the x direction so we saw over here cans let x it will be let's say 220 px and then it will again rotate to the it means it will go back to the zero degree so after this uh, this is the starting and this is the ending so let me just copy this and we'll paste it over here in the two so here instead of zero degree this time it will be 360 let's say test set x it will be the same thing but the rotate it will be minus 360 degree so basically it will make the art go in a circuit so right now if we set this then if we now refresh you will not see any animation there you can see if i refresh over here there is no animation the thing is here we mentioned the keyframe art orbit so we need to mention this in the art class over here so we are going to show over here animation art orbit so this art orbit is basically this one okay so after this we are going to say how long it will take the art to rotate around the sun so let's say it will be 
seven second then the speed will be linear and how many time it will rotate it will be infinite okay so right now if we save this then if we now refresh here here you can see earth and moon is rotating together but we want moon to rotate the earth so for it what you need to do is that uh, let you just copy the keyframes from here also C and control G so here we are going to set to stop art orbit we are going to say over here null orbit and here you can see uh, form transform rotate it will be zero so let's just test the translate x from 220 to 75 px and here 75 px as well so basically everything will stay the same so right now again just like before we need to uh, mention this animation over here as well for the app after so this is basically moon okay so here we are going to say animation it will be moon orbit let's say it will be 3.5 second it will be linear and it will rotate for infinite time save this then refresh here and there you can see moon is right now rotating earth and the earth is rotating the sun so this is what exactly i wanted so i hope you like this tutorial if you have any question or if you want to suggest anything in the comment section you can do that as well thank you very much for watching make sure to subscribe i really appreciate that and i hope to see you in the future tutorials